ओके सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स आज हम लोग देखने वाले हैं एडवर्ब एंड इट्स टाइप्स ओके इन द लास्ट लेक्चर वी हैव सीन वर्ब नाउ वी विल सी एडवर्ब व्हिच इज कनेक्टेड टू वर्ब एज वी हैव सीन दैट एन एडजेक्टिव एन एडजेक्टिव इज अ वर्ड व्हिच टेल्स अस समथिंग स्पेशल अबाउट नाउन और प्रोनाउन सिमिलरली देयर इज एडवर्ब बट एडवर्ब टेल्स अस समथिंग स्पेशल अबाउट वर्ब एंड व्हाट इज वर्ब वर्ब इज द वर्ड इन द सेंटेंस व्हिच डिनोट्स एक्शन ओके अ वर्ब इज अ वर्ड व्हिच डिनोट्स एक्शन इन द सेंटेंस सो द एडवर्ब इज अ वर्ड व्हिच टेल्स अस समथिंग अबाउट द वर्ब मींस द एक्शन इन द सेंटेंस मींस हाउ द एक्शन हैपेंस वेयर द एक्शन हैपेंस व्हेन द एक्शन हैपेंस एंड हाउ मेनी टाइम्स द एक्शन हैपेंस सो द सिंपल एंड शॉर्ट डेफिनेशन ऑफ एडवर्ब इज एंड एडवर्ब इज अ वर्ड which tells us something special about the action verb okay let's write it on the board definition okay an adverb is a word which tells us something special about verb which tells us something special about verb means how the action happens where the action happens when the action happens and how many times the action happens in short we can say that an adverb is an adjective of verb an adverb is an adjective of verb because as the adjective tells us something special about noun and pronoun the adverb tells us something special about verb so according to the function of the adverb there are four main types of adverb number 1 adverb of time adverb of time the word or the adverb which tells us about the time of the happening of the action in the sentence it is called as adverb of time it is called as adverb of time for example if i say that i have started the class just now i have started the class just now now in this sentence the verb is have started the third form of verb okay have started but when have i started the class just now just now so these two words just now are called as adverb of time and if you want to ask the question about the time you have to start the question with when you have to start the question with when when the action happens when the action have happened just now just now so the adverb of time tells us about the time of the happening of the action in the sentence okay the second one is <coughs> adverb of place adverb of place adverb of place means the adverb which tells us where the action happens which tells us about the place where the action happens for example for example if i say
you are making noise here you are making noise here now in this sentence the verb is are making before and the form of verb okay making so where is the noise being made where the noise is being made आवाज कहां पर हो रही है द आंसर इज हियर द आंसर इज हियर हियर ना हियर इज द वर्ड विच टेल्स अस अबाउट द प्लेस वेयर द एक्शन हैपन्स देयर फोर हियर इज एडवर ऑफ प्लेस हियर द वर्ड हियर एच ई आर ई हियर इज एडवर ऑफ प्लेस ओके सो फ्रेंड्स नाउ वी विल सी the third and the fourth type of adverb okay the third one is adverb of manner adverb of manner means it means the adverb which tells us in which manner the action takes place adverb of manner means the adverb which tells us in which manner the action takes place generally they are also called as ly form of adverb they always ends with ly for example fastly slowly okay beautifully wonderfully silently calmly these words are called as adverb of manner because they tells us about the manner in which the action takes place for example sita walks very slowly second raghav reads fastly now in the first sentence the action is walks the verb is walks and the action of walking is happening very slowly how very slowly in the second sentence raghav reads fastly here reads is verb reads is verb action and how the action is happening fastly now in slowly and fastly both the words ends with ly both the words ends with ly therefore we can say it ly form of adverb ly form of adverb the, the proper name of this adverb is adverb of manner because it tells us about the manner in which the action takes place okay the last one is and verb of frequency and verb of frequency frequency means the number of times in which or how many times the action takes place how many times the action takes place frequency frequency means the happening or the number of times how many times the action takes Place. So if I say that, if I say that, I eat twice a day. I eat twice a day. Now in this sentence, the verb is eat. The verb is eat. And how many times the action is going to happen? Twice. Two times. Okay. So once. twice thrice four times 100 times okay umpteen times many times they are called as adverb of frequency now today we have seen about adverb adverb the short and simple definition of adverb is an adverb is a word which tells us something special about verb means action then we have seen that there are four types of adverbs 
adverb of time which tells us about the time on which the action takes place second adverb of place which tells us about the place where the action takes place the third one is adverb of manner which tells us in which manner the action takes place and the last one is adverb of frequency which tells us about the number of times in which the action takes place means how many times the action takes place so if you want to ask the question about adverb of time then you have to start the question with with when with when then you will get the answer about adverb of time if you want to ask the question about adverb of place then you have to start the answer uh, you have to start the question with where then then you will get the answer about the place if you want to ask the question about frequency adverb of frequency then you have to ask the question with how many how many then you will get the answer about adverb of frequency how many times the action takes place and if you want to ask the question about manner adverb of manner then you have to start the sentence with the word how if you start your question with the word how then you will get the answer of adverb of manner how the action takes place so this is a short video about adverb hope all of you uh, will understand it very easily in the next class we will see conjunction it is also an important uh, topic in uh, english grammar conjunction so have a nice day thank you